Hi there and welcome to today's video in which we are going to be looking at customizing lists. Okay, so by now you know how to create a list, you know how to create some bullets with those lists. And yeah, I've got one and I'm, I'm need, I need to customize this a little bit. Okay, so they tell me here, change the bullets to a dollar sign. Let's take this off here. Change the bullets to a dollar sign, uh, size 12, bold and blue. And then they want paragraph spacing three points after. I'm going to select my area. I'm going to go up to my bullets and I've already got this in my bullet library. But if you don't, you can click on define new bullet and you can go and sort it out there. Okay. Now I want to go and I want to click on my dollar. That's fine. Now let's say, for example, you had to do something else. Uh, I'm going to go define new bullet. I'm going to go symbol and I'm going to select. Let's just use the at symbol, for example. Okay. So I use the add symbol. I'm going to click on font now. And what did they want? They wanted it a particular size. I'm going to go with a bigger size just to emphasize my point. Hold and italic. I'm going to change the color as well. I'm going to make it an underlined style. And the underlined color, a different color as well. And I'm going to click OK. You see how it's changed? And when I click OK now, you can see what I've done over there. Then my paragraph spacing. I'll go to my line spacing options and what do they want paragraph spacing after they want it to be three points so i'm going to put in my three click okay and there we go i've customized my list let's go and do another one they want us to change the numbering to roman numbers for example i i i i okay Chiller font, 14 uh, size, uh, double underlined black, right. So we highlight this. First thing we're going to do, you can see the numbering is highlighted. So they want me to change it to the Roman numerals over there. Boom. Done. Okay. However, with that, what do they want me to do? They want me to change the font. So that's fine. I'm going to change that to the Chiller font. They want it to be size 14 and they want a double uh, underline there as well. Got my double underline in black. So all that is sorted. Right. Beautiful. And that's how we can customize our lists.